Peter's in Sheffield. Hello, Peter. Hello, Howie. Uh, just to uh, remind you, um, I'm dreaming of a snow-free Christmas. <laughs> it's you! It's me! I remember that. I thought you might just. Uh, we had a good laugh, didn't we? We did have a good laugh on the radio. Well, we I did. was snowed Certainly in did. Aston a couple of cr uh, Christmases oh, ago. Oh, bless you. Now then, what's your Beatles story? Well, it's it's. Uh, I was at sc I was in the same primary class as John Lennon. Get out of here! Yeah, Mosbits Lane County Primary School. I have at home a photocopy of the admissions book, and on one line it says John Winston Lennon, and on the next line it says Peter Roy Lewis, and that's me. So what was he like? Don't remember. We were just ordinary little lads. He was just like all the rest. Can you remember any of the kids that you were with in primary school, Howie? Uh, not really, no. <laughs> and no, he, not It's really. only since he became famous that I suddenly realised, gosh, I was rubbing shoulders with him every day. So did you get into the Beatles a bit later on then and then realise that you went to school with him? Uh, yeah, very much so. I, I, I worked at Liverpool University and used to go down every lunchtime to the cavern and we... Um, we remember. I remember clearly when the Beatles first came back from ha Hamburg in, in their leather gear, etc., uh, and, and and played at the at the cavern. Um, I, I just love their music. I hope you're going to play. If I give my heart to you, do, 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 do. you know that one? Yes. Beautiful. Listen, do do do, and uh, tell me the secret. That's yeah, the one, isn't it? That's the one. Yeah. You, you hope you'll play it for for us at some stage. OK, well, possibly. That's good. So, you were into the Beatles. Did you uh, go at any time to see them at the Cavern Club? Because you were at Liverpool, weren't you? In Liverpool As I say, I, 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 we, I, I, I worked at the university, and just half a, mi half a, uh, uh, half a mile down Brownlow Hill uh, was, the, was the Cavern in Matthews Street. What, what was it Matthews like, then? Well, very sweaty, very hot. It was, uh, you know, it was underground. It was, a ex it was a sewer, wasn't it, previously? If I remember rightly, yeah, that's right. Yeah, and, I think and, originally it was, wasn't it? That's right. And and uh, everything sort of happened in that small area. Rushworth and Draper um, was the music shop with all the pianos and the guitars and all the Beatles records being sold just round the corner. And it was Frank Hesse's where we all went. We all congregated where the latest guitars came in. I had a band. Um, I had a skiffle group, the Union City Skiffle Group, and um, you know the Beatles were originally the Quarrymen that's right. Skiffle Group, and we actually the Carlton Cinemas. Uh, did a, a series of competitions where we performed between the films and um, we actually beat the Beatles, uh, we actually beat the Quarrymen in, in, that, um, in that skiffle competition. They became the Beatles and we became the Liverpool Raiders. And was it just as exciting for you at those times as it was Oh, it was the absolutely Beatles? brilliant. I remember um, we went... Um, there's a, there's a, there's a theatre in Liverpool called the Empire Theatre and there was um, a concert being put on by, you won't remember him because you're a bit younger than me, uh, a guy called Little Richard. Oh, yeah. A real rocker. And um, he was top of the show and the Beatles were the supporting act. But, of course, we'd all gone to see the Beatles and Love Me Do had just come out and they played that. It was the first song they, they played on the evening. And poor old Little Richard didn't get a look in on that evening. We felt so embarrassed for him. So you, we were, you we knew were all you were, there to see the Beatles. You knew you were witnessing something really historic, did you? I really do. I mean, their music is, is fantastic, isn't it? I mean, the melodies, the... Oh, the, 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 the new rhythm, etc. We were just lucky to be part of something which was uh, quite unique, wasn't it, in the 60s? It was indeed. Peter and Sheffield, thank you ever so much for talking to us. What a great story. Went to school with John Lennon.